He's definitely a mentor. If I said to one of the girls, if you're not playing for yourself, at least play for Leak. For more than 20 years, Lafayette softball coach Jeff Leak prided himself on the fact that he had never missed a game. But sometimes life has other ideas. The doctor said come by and see me next week. He wasn't sure of anything, but he said they did a biopsy and come by next week and, and then later I find out it's cancerous. At 48 years old, Leak went in for a routine colonoscopy, but what the doctors found wasn't routine. Immediately met with a surgeon and, and found out that uh, I had stage 3 colorectal cancer. And he and the doctors attacked it with eight rounds of chemotherapy. It's all that it consumes your thoughts every day, but the treatments, you know, they progressively get worse. But he kept fighting, and after undergoing surgeries earlier this month, the Lafayette ball coach blessed to know there are no signs of cancer anymore. It takes a lot more than medicine to get through this. And, and I've been lucky uh, with my doctors, surgeons, oncologists, and all of them are great. The support that I got from, from friends, family, co-workers, the school, softball girls, those are the things that get you through those, those days when they're pretty hard. It's been a long, tough, uncertain six months for Leek and his family. But as he continues the road of recovery, Leek coming back to the place he calls home. I've always believed this. Any day you can be at the ballpark is a good day. Now he's never been truly fully away from the team but when he has been gone this group making sure to show their love and support. Didn't really say anything I actually just went up to Leek all like teary-eyed and I gave him a hug and I he didn't say anything back he said thank you. In my four years of playing softball I never I'm, I don't remember him ever missing one game so it's definitely a lot to see him miss one. Even when he was done with it like big yeah. time he was still at every practice over the summer he yes was, he was always at everything. Cancer doesn't care who you are or what your plans might be. Leek knows he is blessed and he is wanting to help others now because of the support he's received. If I can talk about me and that causes one extra person to go get, get a routine checkup and a colonoscopy and, or whatever checkups they may be due for with their doctor and catch something before it, 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 it hits them. Chris Roush, KQ2 News.